Unlike with your regular PC where you usually interact with all of your storage via Windows Explorer where you get to see all the files at once, with phones you don't usually do that. Instead you just go to apps like for example your gallery where you just see photos and videos. But what about if you do want to go into nitty gritty and see your entire storage and file system in general? Well, on Android phones, it is very simple to do so by just going into the Files app. It will usually have a bit of a different name depending on what exact flavor of Android you have. So it could be called something like My Files, Files, Storage, anything along those lines. On Samsung phones, which constitute most Android devices, it is called My Files and it's usually located in the Samsung folder by default. So if we go into there, and as you can see, My Files is right there. So once you go into that, you'll be able to see all of the files currently on your phone and you'll be given some categories straight away. Some stuff that you may be familiar with like for example images and videos which give you a similar breakdown to something like a gallery app but it's more about moving files in larger numbers rather than viewing each image or video in detail like in that app and of course you can also do stuff like access or the downloads you have from the internet. So if you ever download anything and you weren't sure where it went, well that's exactly where it is. You can also go into the exact file structure by going on the internal storage or if you have any SD cards or well, this is exactly where they're going to show up as well. So if we go into that you can see all of the folders we have here and at this point it becomes pretty similar to something like say Windows Explorer. You can just go into any folder, copy or move files to any other folders and of course make new folders as well. Most of these here are just your default that you get with the Android system and if you're wondering the DCIM folder as you see right there that is the one where all of your media goes. So stuff like your photos and videos you take as well as some media storage from other apps that all goes into the DCIM folder. So you can do pretty much everything from that view and the exact user interface you get depends on which exact flavor of Android you have. However, that still doesn't grant you access to seeing their entire file structure. In order to do that, you actually need to root your device. Once you do so, you have access to everything including stuff like the boot drive, which includes pretty much the whole operating system and well everything else that this system needs to actually boot as the name implies. Now if you prefer navigating via Windows Explorer, you can always just connect your phone up to your PC and then do it that way. It will just show up as an external drive and you can just click into it and you'll see the exact same directories but in the regular Windows interface we know and are used to. So that's pretty much everything you need to know about how to navigate all the various files and folders in your Android device. Again, there is a lot you can really explore in those various file structures once you go into that files app. So if you found this video helpful, maybe subscribe to How To Authority from like this in the future.